With the Gamma Draconis system secure, the task force of Terran and the suit and scientists is now examining the subspace portal. At this point, the scientists have ruled out the possibility the devices of Shivan origin. Dr. Mina Hargrove, leader of the research team, has issued a report of his preliminary findings. An excerpt of this report follows. The subspace portal is unlike any Sheevan construction we have yet encountered. Though Sheevans demonstrate considerable diversity as a species, all Sheevan technology possesses certain distinctive properties. None is present in the subspace device, which means we must look elsewhere for the portal's origin. We do know that the device is very, very old, on the order of several thousand years. The field generated by the interlocking movement portal's components creates a subspace vortex, connecting one part of the universe to another. Dr. Hargrove theorizes that whoever built this device may have used it to stabilize a jump node on the verge of collapse. Dr. Hargrove is correct. This technology is a tremendous discovery. By constructing our own portal, we might be able to reopen the soul jump node in Delta Serpentis. Since the destruction of the Lucifer caused the node to collapse 32 years ago, Earth has remained isolated from the GTVA. We might also be able to stabilize subspace nodes that are currently too volatile for travel, thus creating routes to systems previously unexplored. Our military operation will focus on what lies on the other side of the subspace portal. Let's determine where the node leads, the extent of the Sheevan presence there. Above all, we must prevent the Sheevans from returning to Gamma Draconis. Because the portal will remain active while the research team studies the technology, our systems are vulnerable to attack. Allied Command has deemed this an acceptable risk given the potential benefits. At 1540 hours, the GTD Aquitaine entered the subspace portal in Gamma Draconis and jumped to our current position. We have entered a nebula, a vast and dense ionized field, and possibly the remnant of a supernova. We have traveled farther than any Terrans in the history of subspace travel. The nebula has severely limited the Aquitaine's long-range sensors. We are deploying our fighter wings to explore the immediate vicinity and determine the extent of the enemy presence. Each fighter squadron will deploy a flight of four wings. Alpha, Zeta, Iota, and Kappa will patrol a series of four waypoints. Zeta wing will lead this sortie, so follow Zeta-1 and do not stray. Be advised the nebula could interfere with your onboard systems. The ionized field will compromise your sensors, even within combat range. Iota Wing, you are cleared to take off. Kappa Wing, you have clearance. Zeta Wing, go. Alpha Wing, go. Confirmation. I can't see a thing in this mess. Rather be fighting the NTF if you ask me. I never signed on for hunting Sheevans. Don't kid yourself. We're the ones being hunted, pilot. 
Command should shut down that portal and send the Aquitaine back to Deneb. We've got no business being out here. If Command needs your opinion, they'll promote you to Admiral. Now shut up and focus. All flights report in. This is IOTA-1. Sensors are picking up Zilch, Command. We're flying blind out here. Alpha-2 here. Nothing to report. This is Ada-1. All clear. Kappa Wing, what's your status? Over. Kappa Wing, this is Allied Command. Please respond. IOTA Wing, investigate Kappa's last waypoint. The ionized field is interfering with our transmission. survive out here on their own. This nebula could be 10 or 20 light years in diameter. Finding a single ship would be impossible. Unless the Sheevans find us first. Do we have a status update on Kappa Wing? Negative. No word from Kappa yet. We'll find out in debriefing. Something big. A cruiser or a corvette? Do you recognize the configuration? Is it a Rakshasa or a Kane? Negative command. It's a Terran cruiser. Fenris class. 
There's no Allied ship authorized in your vicinity. Hail them, pilot. This is Data Wing of the 107th Ravens, GTD Aquitaine. Please identify yourself. This is Captain Arthur Romig of the GTC Trinity. We have sustained heavy damage, and our jump drive is inoperative. We need immediate assistance. Your designation is incorrect, Romig. Your ship defected to the NTF ten days ago. You have been stripped of your rank and citizenship in the GTVA. Surrender the Trinity, or be destroyed. As captain of the NTC Trinity, I surrender on the condition you get us the hell out of here. Roger that. What's your status? We repelled the Sheevan attack, but engines sustained critical damage. I powered down non-essential systems so the Sheevans wouldn't detect us. We've been drifting ever since. What's your assessment of the damage? Some components were destroyed in the attack, but my chief engineer thinks a field repair is possible. We will send a damage control team with the necessary components. Transmit your diagnostics. Transmitting now. What were you doing out here, Romic? As a prisoner of war, my rights are protected under the Beta Aquilae Convention. I will answer no questions, Command. I thought Rebels didn't recognize Baytac. No, but we do, Pilot. Damage control has been deployed. They should be arriving momentarily. Discovery here. Initiating docking procedure. Watch our backs, little friends. Uh, yes, sir. We'll take him down. to be boarded, Trinity. Trinity standing by. Docking point secure. Okay, Romic, we're taking you and your crew into custody. Follow the drill and no one gets hurt.
take him down. Heads up, enemy wing closing in. confronted an overwhelming Shivan force in a hostile environment. Under these circumstances, there was nothing you or anyone else could have done to save the Trinity and our boarding party. You were lucky to survive this sortie, pilot. We have heard nothing from Kappa Wings since they vanished from our sensors. Unfortunately, we must presume the worst. They will be listed MIA unless we find evidence to the contrary. Our search parties have found no trace of these fighters. The presence of the Trinity deepens the enigma of the NTF secret agenda. What was the Trinity doing out here? And what does Bosch know about the subspace portal? All patrols have uncovered an extensive Shivan force in the nebula. Command will deploy more warships through the subspace portal to assist with our mission of exploration and containment. IOTA and Epsilon wings encountered two Shivan cruisers near our current location. When our reinforcements arrive, we will move against them.